Hello fellow toppers, it's Loafa here, and today I'm coming back to get started on Act 3. And today I'm going to be unlocking the first two parts of yeah, the new act. So yeah, we're going to be unlocking the fourth wagon, which looks pretty nice, and we've got the um, building as well, which I think says full pool locker. I can't, I can't read that. Pool locker, that's the one. But yeah, that does look um, like an interesting building as well. So yeah, let's get back into the dialogue. And yeah, let's get going. I've got good news and bad news. Which do you desire first? I'm a good news kind of guy. I've tracked down the amulet to a place called Lord Montgomery's Castle. The bad news is that it's not in this version of the game. We did an expansion pack. Where do we get that without waiting weeks for a special order? Three words. Comic book guy. Excellent thinking. And Death Knight can assist his fellow companions in getting there. With some kind of magic potion? Sadly no. With my mule-drawn hops wagon. Tally-ho. There we go. Fantastic, the filth wagon. Here we go, and yeah, if you're wondering about the um, human human power plant video with uh, Lord Montgomery, I'm going to be unlocking that. Um, yeah, in a couple of days' time, I won't be able to upload tomorrow, but I'll be doing that alongside the mystery box opening as well, so that's going to be an absolute blast, that video, so do stick around for that. So, the filth wagon. Let's see this. Expanding one's horizons. Yo, comic book guy, we're looking for an expansion pack to Vaults and Vandals. Ever heard of it? A game in which I possess a 17th level fighter. Doi. Hello, no. Darn, sorry to trouble you, sir. Ugh, apparently my sarcasm is too sophisticated for you. I assume you're looking for the Lord Montgomery's Castle expansion pack. The very same. That'll be two thousand dollars. Two thousand bucks? That's crazy. What do we do now? I have an idea. You're going to bully him into giving it to us? Please, I'm more than just a bully. The fool locker. <laughs> Dear me, I'm um, struggling to remember the episode now. See how these buildings are a bit of a blur uh, to me. So yes, the filth wagon. So let's check that out, and it does look pretty nice, got to be honest. It does look pretty neat. Look at that. That is a really nice animation. With all the flies. That's fantastic. Amazing. So there yeah, fourth wagon. Pretty good. And um, yeah, obviously... Just found in the store that it's five donuts, which I think is reasonably really reasonable for the price that it is. And if you want to make like a whole medieval area, that is really reasonable. As normally these things tend to be at least ten donuts, probably normally in the region of twenty donuts if you want to get multiple. So yeah, really pleased with the reasonable reasonable price. Sadly, there's no money in XP percentage boost, um, but hey, I'm more glad to be honest that they're making it accessible for people to get multiple of. So there we go, and so then it's time to go on to the full locker. So yeah, let's get into that. Already did. Nelson, why did you bring us back in the game? We need money to buy the expansion pack, right? So we run around here and loot and sell everything that's n not nailed down. Then the gold coins will appear in real life. So we're kind of buying all Springfield here. Normally I'd object to exploits like this, but since it's my neck on the line, I'm in. Awesome. Right. The Fool Locker. And honestly, this looks like another great building. Um, I know that people do have a bit of a... Uh, have strong opinions on these buildings, but personally, I really, really like this. And we'll put it uh, down like that, actually. I think that does look, make it look a bit nicer. So there we go. Here's 2,000 bucks in gold coins. Now hand over the expansion pack. Gold? 
whatever. I assume it's slightly safer than crypto. You've got yourself a deal. <laughs> Great. Now let's get our own expansion pack on. Wait, what's Mohas doing? Here you are, sir. One limited edition, uh, limited edition Happy Little Elves comic. I had an extra gold coin. Don't judge me, fellas. Awesome. So there we go. So, yeah, the next bit is going to be the mystery box token. And obviously I'm going to be coming back for that tomorrow alongside the uh, human power plants. That is, uh, yeah, awesome. And so let's go and have a look at the full locker then. Heads up! And I think for this building, we're going to need to... Um, did say, I was going to say put a road down here just so we can see it in its full glory I think there we go let's see it so that's where buildings come the from the full locker yeah and um, it's probably a better way to design this but it does look better on the side I think and, uh, oh no look, it works it works either way to be honest so there we go the full locker so yeah really really like the unique design of this building um, yeah, the attention to the detail in the building is great. Yeah, so um, love the look of it. So let's give a listen to the noise. Hmm. Profiling the jesters. Let's listen to that again. The uh, intricate flute noise. Huh? What the... I just love... I love all these noises with a little bell and everything. Yeah. Um, I think it's fantastic to be honest so there we go yeah so two really really nice prizes there um so yeah really really chuffed honestly normally things tend to drop off by act three but that has been a real result for me in my opinion it's um yeah and hopefully the standard ball increase there's certainly lots more things to uh, yeah in the update so and the decoration bundle looks insane obviously got another great building and we got act four as well so yeah exciting times ahead do stick around for that and um yeah i just wanted to mention that um at some point we're going to be releasing the results for the springfield penitentiary uh, designs competition uh, we haven't forgot about that we're going to be getting to do that um at some point um also yeah yeah just um wanted to say that I'm going to be visiting towns as I haven't done that for a while and I know a lot of you have want, been wanting me to do it so yeah and yeah if you want a town to be visited in a future video then please add me with the code LOOFFERVILL and also before you go if you want to get involved in competitions get help with your town um, and get a full list of friends for your town as well if you're starting off and you need some advice and get friends then please do hop along to the Simpsons Tap for Lounge Discord server as yet yeah, you're going to be able to get a load of help there. There's a lovely community of people there. So yeah, I'd highly recommend joining. So that is sadly going to bring me to the end of this video. But I'll see you yeah, for the next one tomorrow. And good.